Hi everyone, and thanks for joining me. Today I'm going to show you how to make a website for a bookkeeper. So we're gonna go through everything you need to know, make it simple and easy, to just create a simple professional website for your bookkeeping service. So first thing you do, go to mightysites.com. Uh, it's only $9 a month, and there's a seven day free trial. It's a platform built specifically, so you can choose from all types of different small business website themes and create your website really quickly and easily. It's got the an easy to use editor and that's what we're gonna to use today to show you how to create a website for your bookkeeping service. So the first thing that, that I suggest you do is first just look up bookkeeping service, type in bookkeeper, find the bookkeeping service website template. That's what we're going to use to get started. So I'm just gonna click on that. And then the first thing I, I'm gonna put in is just, it's gonna ask me some basic information about my bookkeeping business. So I'm just gonna put Keegan, Keegan's bookkeeping, uh, let's put Keegan's bookkeeping service. And then I can put where I'm located. I'm gonna put in Denver, Colorado, and then type of business. So again, Mighty Sites works for all different types. You have to select uh, service, right? Or you could select other, um, but service business, because a bookkeeping service, you're providing a service for others. So then I click continue. And now this instantly generates a simple professional website for my bookkeeping service, which is really nice. So if you're a bookkeeper, you know, your, your specialty is in providing bookkeeping services, not necessarily building websites. So to have a simple professional website generated for you that you can then use as your online business card to send potential customers to and help you get found more online and drive customers uh, to your business, uh, especially you could be doing this full time or as a side business, you know, building a simple professional website is the way to go. So once the template is generated for me, I've got a few different things I can do. So it's made to be a really easy edit system so that you can just instantly generate a website, no breaking the bank with expensive web designers or you know complicated platforms. To update any section, all you do is update, click on update section, and then you can go in here and put in your information. So I'll just type, start with putting in my email. This is my email. And then I'm just gonna click show email on the site. So I want people to be able to contact me that way. Put in my phone number too. So this is my phone number. So I'll click save. Now my phone number is included there. If you wanna put your address, you can, um, but a lot of times, you know, you may just be doing this remote, you may not have a physical location. You just put in the, the city and state that you serve. If you do have any social media that you're using, so let's just say you have a Twitter account, I'm just gonna type in twitter.com. Um, now my Twitter logo populates. I could also type in my Facebook page. Um, so again, you could, you just copy and paste, but I'll just type it in for now. Um, and then save that. Your LinkedIn would be another good one. Um, if you have a LinkedIn profile, YouTube channel, Instagram, you can include all of those. So I'll just save those close. Now that top header with my contact information is in. That's really nice and easy. Next thing you might want to do um, is add more items to your menu. You can do that right here. Simply, you know, type in what you want it to say, choose where you want it to link. You can do all types of different links to another website, to a different place on this website, to uh, an action like calling you or driving directions or automatically emailing you, or you can upload a PDF and have it linked there. So that's how you add items to your menu. The other thing you may want to do is have a logo. So if you don't have one already, um, what I'd suggest you check out is canva.com. And I'll just show you this really quick. Uh, it's really simple and easy to create an account and create a logo. You just create a design, create a logo, and then you can actually probably just type in here bookkeeper and look at that. So it, it automatically has some options for bookkeeping um, and it'll give you some different layouts you can choose from. But I'll just, I'll just select this for now and call this my bookkeeper logo. So I'm just gonna simply download that, download it as a JPEG, and there we go. Without paying for any design or anything, there's a really cheap and easy way to create a logo for your business. So now I just go back over here. I'm gonna upload my bookkeeper business logo. Once it uploads, I'm just gonna click save. And now you can see I've got my logo, and I, I think that, you know, I obviously want that to be bigger. So again, Mighty Sites is a really simple, easy to use website builder for bookkeepers. So all I need to do here is to just click on make it bigger. So I just click on this button and it literally makes it bigger. But you can see how that's creating probably more space than I want there. So I'm just gonna go to this little pencil icon and click on it. 
and it's going to open up all of these different tools for editing images. So I can decorate, frame, filter, right? All of these different things. Right now I just need to use the cropping tool. So I'm just gonna bring that down. I'm gonna bring this back up and then I'm probably gonna bring it in a little bit because there's just too much white space around this logo for me. Um, so I think that looks pretty good. So I'm gonna click done. It's gonna automatically re-upload the new version of the logo. I can just save that. And now you can see that the logo fills the space better to the point where I actually think I'm gonna make it a little smaller now. There we go, I think that looks good. And then you can you know, play around with the filters, things like that um, to find a fit that, that works best for you. Next thing I'll do, because um, I think this top header is looking pretty sharp now, is I'll go down here and maybe I just wanna update this at all. Um, so you, know, you could just edit any of this hero. So maybe I'll just say bookkeeper, for small business, right? Maybe I just want a, a shorter message there, offering easy and efficient solutions for bookkeeping and payroll. I mean, that's pretty great. Let's just say I wanna cut that down too, just to show you how to edit efficient solutions. I'm just gonna put these in, in capitals and let's try uh, an ampersand here. And payroll support, that's wonderful. I'll just put payroll instead of processing. So there we go, so I'll save that and close. So now you can see my bookkeeping service website is coming along really nicely. Book a free consultation online. So one of the best things about this is you can link to wherever you want. So let's just say that you have a calendar, uh, an online calendar through something like Calendly. So if you set up a Calendly calendar, it's free. And you can actually go in here and uh, this is my you know uh, demonstration Calendly account, but this is all free and people can pick a time on my calendar here. So let's just say you wanted to advertise at a free um, consultation. You can just say, you know, book free consultation, or maybe just, you know, keep it simple and just say um, request consultation. Um, and so they can, they can, then you would just paste in the link and confirm and save. And so now, this request consultation button will actually open up my calendar. So when people come to your website, um, they can go right to your calendar. So now you've got your social links, your contact information. It's starting to look really <laughs> professional because we filled it out. Now this button uh, links to your calendar, which is really nice. You've got another contact button here you can do anything you want with. So you can change any of the, the words and phrases here for all of the buttons too. So let's just say um, you want this to be uh, call now right? Maybe people are going to be on mobile and you want them to just call from their phone. I can check, set that as call now and I can set it to my phone, click save, close. Now, if somebody clicks on that on their smartphone, it'll already call my, it'll automatically call my business. I can also, if I ever decide I don't want something there, I can just uh, go in here and I, I can cancel, delete the link, confirm, save, and kind of get rid of the button too. Um, you know, if you really don't want something there too, but uh, for right now, I'm just going to say call now because I think that's a nice call to, call to action. And I'm just going to choose to have it actually call me um, if somebody clicks on that link. So there we go. So now that section is coming along nice. And let's just say you, you again, this, this Mighty Sites automatically writes the text for you, which is really nice. But per, let's just say that you want to customize the text. Um, and you can see that it says Keegan's Bookkeeping Service here. And you'll see that it actually says... Um, specific things like Denver, Colorado, located in Denver, right? So it, it automatically tries to write the copy with, with your business in mind. But if you want to rewrite any part of this, simply go to the section you want to, click on update section, and then you can go here and just type something like, this is a, this is how to make a website for a book keeper. So I can just type that in and click save, and now that text is updated, right? So it's really simple and easy to use. Again, you can do the same thing with the about section. You can use, uh, you can upload a new photo and use the editing tools, but all these photos are pre-licensed for you to use too. So you can go right ahead and, and launch the site using these photos here as well. Now, this is a really great part of this. This is your call to action um, contact form. So actually, if someone clicks on contact, it'll come down right here to this, this form, which is really nice. Um, and then of course, your your phone number or email will be on here too if you choose to display those on the website as well as your social media. So if I'm somebody who's looking for a bookkeeper, I could come in here, I've just found your website, it looks nice, professional, I understand what you do, I could type my name, let me just add my email address. 
and then my phone number. And then here I'll just say this, um, I am interested in bookkeeping services. And then I can just click send. And once I do that as the consumer, I get this nice little message on the front end saying thank you. And then if I go back here to stop editing, so you can see what the website looks like without the, the update buttons now, now you've got a really nice professional website for your bookkeeping service, uh, really simply and easily too. So now I can go back to the site dashboard and I can uh, go here and I'll see one new lead, right? So you'll actually get an email to your email that you use to log in for your Mighty Site telling you you've got a new person interested in your bookkeeping services. And then you can come here to your website dashboard and go to view leads. And then right here, you'll receive the person's name, email, phone number, and then their little message. And you can reach out to them by email or give them a call to fully earn their business. But that's where you're going to get leads for your business too, right through that form, uh, which is really nice. So then if I go back here to update your Mighty Site, I can also, one last thing to show you, I can change the colors. So you'll see this little paint can here. And let's just say that, you know, I'd prefer a, like a grayer color or maybe red really fits with my logo and brand or like a yellow or a bright blue. Just depends on what type of business. There are new color palettes being added all the time. So you can go right in here and you can um, select the color palette that you feel like is most appropriate for your business and just go ahead and change that out. It'll change out the color theme all the way throughout. So just something to match your logo and your brand. Um, but there are literally, there are tons of different color themes. Just pick the one that works best for your business. Um, you can switch them at any time too. So you're not, you're not locked in. But once that's all set, just go back here to the site dashboard and connect a custom domain. So I just go right in here and if I own a domain from Google domain or GoDaddy or domain.com, any place like that, I just go in, I paste my domain name and then there's really simple step-by-step -step instructions uh, that you can provide to your registrar to just get this connected. It comes with a secure certificate so it'll you'll have a secure website just like this with a safe connection um, and you can connect your domain uh, quickly and easily. And that's how you make a website for a bookkeeper using Mighty Sites. Wishing you the best of luck with your business.